game plan today. My buddy's on his way over and he's got two husky dogs and a sled. So I'm excited to check this out. I've never seen them in action, but there's still snow up on the mountain. We're heading up. All my gear goes on this sled. I don't even have to carry a thing besides, you know, whatever I want. And uh, they're gonna take my stuff back in for me to our campground. We're gonna camp overnight. And then in the morning, we're gonna get up and we're gonna play some trail cams and some locations that we wanna check out. And uh, hopefully we get some wildlife out there and some good times. So I'll check in with you guys when we get to the uh, trailhead and uh, let you guys check out the dogs and how we pack everything up. Really looking forward to it. And I'm especially looking forward to the fact that I don't have to carry anything back there. So see you soon. Thanks for watching. Nice up here, little patches down there. Straight ahead. Sierra's got, I don't even know, 15 foot snowpack this year. It was ridiculous, but beautiful. You can see the mountains in the background up there. Tons of snow up there still. I believe you can ski in some areas this uh, year up until July, I was told. Yeah, oh yeah. It's gonna be so, one of the longest years we've it's ever It's gonna had. be uh, 4th of July on the slopes. <laughs> That's crazy. strapped we're about to head out we're gonna get these hound dogs out of the car that's Dakota Let's see her over there <laughs> it's gonna be so cool to have them they're gonna run perimeter around us while we're going through and they're gonna pull this sled right here don't mind that beer right there that's just for show we don't do that kind of thing. <laughs> Never. No, I don't have the, it was still recorded that, huh? What? Oh, I don't have the um, upgraded, off grid. Oh. Russ got the sled all set up. We're gonna get the dogs out of the car and head out. Short hike in, set up camp and just kick it. Made it to our little campground. We got a nice creek below us, or possibly a river. Is it a river? It's a Chris Chris called a creek, but it's a river right now. Yeah. We're surrounded by these giant boulders, so we have kind of a natural little shelter. It's a fire pit right here. Got a fire pit. Pretty cool. I pitched, I pitched right there. Yeah. Um, I brought a shovel, so if you want to dig your the snow out of the way, it's up to you. Yeah. I've, I've camped out there in the open right there. Mm -hmm. um, if you want your privacy, the Ricky Ricky, right over here. Through these rocks. No, I'm cool. I'll probably do right here, maybe. You can do right there. It's usually where I put the dogs and they fit. Oh, really? <laughs> well, then I'm not putting there. There's probably some dookies back there. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Thanks for the heads up. <laughs> but you don't bring a... Uh, it's been a, it's so long. They're, they're gone. You want some water? You guys thirsty? Usually we set up our chairs right here. I put the dog, the line right here for the dogs. Mm -hmm. Before I put it, I put it over here sometimes. Perfect trees for a hammock. I should have brought a hammock. Oh yeah, for sure. J Dane sleeps in a hammock. Oh, he does. He That's doesn't how even he bring camps. a tent. Does he have a tip thing that goes over the top? No. Oh, the he's... hairy fool that mosquitoes can't get through that. It's like wearing a wool sweater. <laughs> it's quiet. <laughs> You're being videotaped. <laughs> he's gonna get you. Anyway. Looks cool. Might as well set up camp and go explore. Yeah, it's a beautiful spot. It's got a natural chimney right here. Mm. So the air gets drawn through, through mm. and it goes straight up. So you don't have a problem with the wind coming through and blowing yeah, the fire everywhere. You burn, yeah. So 
We usually hide our wood down there. We'll chop some in the summer. Mm -hmm. Keep it dry. Yeah, we're gonna stay dry underneath those rocks. There's a few big logs under there. <clears throat> but this is our typical spot we've been coming to since we were 18. Sit. Around. Around. Yep. Good boy. He loves it. He's smelling something. Yeah, there's been deer in here. Let's go this way. Okay. We're gonna go check out a different spot down here. This is gonna be one of the first spots in the forest they're gonna come for food, the first greenery. Right. Down in here. See, with the coverage. With the coverage and the shadow. There's water right there. There's food. Everything else around here is dry. No greenery. You'd have mm -hmm. to go down to the main <clears throat> river to get it. Yeah, this is a good spot. The water's just bubbling up through this ground and it's all lush over here. Yeah. That's bedding. For sure, dude. Surprise, there's no. Yeah, see, he's smelling it. Mm -hmm. yeah, for sure. Yeah, he's smelling it for sure. Is that a deer, Dakota? Hmm? A bear. You think a bear? Could be a bear, but yeah. I don't see any bear shit. Yeah, I was going to say, I haven't seen much scat, so. And I'm not seeing any big print. We're checking out this perimeter around this marsh. It kind of divides where there's public and private land. So the private land is owned by a logging company that will give access. Uh, I don't know how it works, so we're gonna look into it. But either way, we're on the cusp of a really good spot. So we're gonna keep looking. Look at the dogs. At least sliding down the snowbank. Marky. <laughs> it's mine. That's awesome. <laughs> this is why you bring dogs. Oh, yeah. It's a snow angel. <laughs> it's a snow goober. He's marking his territory, man. If I saw that, I'd say, what species is that? <laughs> uh oh. He's gonna slide down to that. You're nuts, you know that? So we're placing trail cams on this meadow right here because it's pretty much an oasis in this area. It's all been burned through on the outskirts and this is all fresh growth and grass and tons of water, plus the snow's melting. So I wanna put it on this tree because the sun goes that way and I know you're not supposed to put a trail cam facing the sun so I think this is the best bet if you guys have any tips feel free to chime in but this is the one I've chosen and the dog likes it too so we're gonna go for it come back in a couple months and maybe even sooner see what we got okay we're gonna give this one a shot seems like a good spot And this is the, the really good one, so I don't want it to get stolen, that's for sure. Try to lock this thing down. And there she goes. Make sure the shot's good. I want to get that tree line over there. So, let me go this way just a little bit more. And then should be good. Right there. Alright. And I'm going to make her live. We're going to do 1080p video, which is going to be kind of interesting. 
five, four, three, two, one. We are now live. Probably gonna start recording me, but whatever. going to camouflage our trail cam just a little bit. Every little bit helps because if someone spots it, you never know. They could take it and that just would suck. You wait a month and come out here and it's gone. A lot of wasted time. Number one trail cam is set. We'll come back out here in about a month and we got it on video cam so we should have some high quality 1080p video cam footage of hopefully some big old bucks. It was a chilly night, obviously, with the snow on the ground. We're packing it up right now. Gonna get out of here. Go get a cup of coffee and something to eat. What do you think? You guys wanna go? You wanna go? Let's go. Tell dad to hurry up. Tell him. Super chilly morning. Woo. Nobody likes a cry baby. We have some criers over here. Not you, Dakota. You're kind of a sweet little boy, huh? Chill. But this girl. Can we get a howl? No? Anyway. Packing it up, heading out of here. Hiking out. Bit of an uphill climb now. Good boy. Good boy. 